All right, what is up, you beautiful people, and welcome back to the Six Aura, bro. We're playing some Manx today. Let's get it, boys. Um, I'm just gonna roll out with two links. I'll be honest. I'm just gonna scout it out here, but um, Six Aura, bro, brought one of fires. I don't, I don't really think there's any need to explain that one. We have six ores. Um, so yeah, I don't know what exactly I'm gonna do with Manx, but it probably has something to do with LMG boys and um, just large amounts of them. Let's see. Um, hmm, huh, hmm, 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 these are not good for LMG boys. I, actually, no, Force is pretty good for LMG boys. I'm against Statman, no! No! Oh, no! Statman is actually the bane of my existence. Alright, um, I don't know what I'm supposed to do against that. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I gotta kill Gary, and then survive the banelings. Oh, jeez, uh, hmm, hmm. Alright, well, if you guys saw the Tychus, like, glitch exploit thingy, where it's like, uh, stuff's cooldown is drastically re reduced, I wonder if the Sky Fury and the Aegis Guard shields have a reduced cooldown. Because if they do, this might be pretty good. I'm gonna go water then. Uh, it was a little funky, but I'm gonna go water here. I'm gonna send in, I'm gonna send out one Aegis Guard here, because, like, this thing, this thing's on cooldown, right? 43 seconds. This thing's also on cooldown. So, I don't know, boys. Uh, ooh, blood? Hmm. Blood could work uh, if I have a thick enough unit to survive. Because uh, once, once Stepman sees its, uh, once Stepman sees its, its Manx, you really, all you gotta do is just bury Manx with a bunch of Banelings, and he'll, like, get really sad. Um, that's, that's pretty much it, boys. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go for some blood here. Let's go for some more blood here. Um, so much blood, but no extra life. How am I supposed to survive, boys? Uh, I'm gonna get some force. Uh, ah! Ah! Tell me, how am I supposed to live? How am I supposed to live like this? You know? How am I supposed to live? Alright. Because I, I, I can't roll LMG boys into Banelings. That's just asking to get... Beamed. Um, I think what I'm gonna do here is just toss out some Sky Furies. I'm gonna get Earth here. I'm not screw it, boys. Uh, I need one life or, or something. Give me, give me some. Ah! Uh, this is like the one time I'm like not thrilled to see blood. But you know what? I might be kind of thrilled to see it actually. You know, let's 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 go for it. We got some extra cooldown reduction here, so the high how high grade stim packs are gonna be out here. Aegis Guard is probably not going to go down too too easily, and I'm just going to go for Ultralisk. Okay, there we go. Uh oh, he's he's getting beamed by roaches. Ah, shoot. Okay. Yeah, because I have triple blood, but I have no extra life, so my LMG boys are like... If they don't die instantly, which is a big if, um, they'll have fun. I think once I get Ultralisk, I'm going to slap down Warhounds, uh, and then I think that'll that'll be it. I think that's the strategy. A little bit, a little bit, it's a little bit strange, but Warhounds, uh, Warhounds will, will beam, will beam all our opponents here. There we go, um, there we go, I got, I got a scan. I don't know if that's gonna be helpful, though. Um, does his LMG, oh, he's got really powerful LMG boys, so I guess, uh, he'll make up for the fact that I have no powerful LMG boys. Let me get the incapacitator shells, smart servos, there we go. Come on, Aegis Guard. Aegis Guard's just getting dinged down here. Sky Fury, man, the focus strike algorithm is pretty tough here. Um, there we go. Gary's gonna go down here. Sky Fury, oh, didn't have the revive protocol. Aegis Guard just refuses to die right now because uh, I've got three blood on him, so he's just gonna he's just gonna keep healing, boys. He's gonna keep healing. <laughs> oh man, and there's like some super fast Stukov uh, Stukov units running out there. <laughs> what is it? Alright, I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get get it like this. I don't know. I'm gonna get an ultralisk here. I know those lings are kind of like a little too close to the ultralisk. You know, kind of like in a suboptimal place. But don't don't worry about it here. I'll put them, I'll put them over here. Ah, there we go. I don't know, something like that. I'm a little vulnerable to Igorb right now though. But uh, whatever, it's fine. I'll just slap that down over here. How much range does these guys have? Whoa, 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 whoa. he has five, bro. He's got 10 range on these things. He's got 13 range. Yeah, you know, I'm just gonna have to ride on the back of my Stukov ally here. Uh, I'm gonna ride on. I'm gonna ride on. You know, like the Pokemon. Ride on. 
right on these. Anyways, uh, wait, the tanks have such a long range they aren't sieging. Uh oh, wait, but hold on. Uh, these roaches are kind of a problem. Um, they're a problem because I'm not able to kill them. Uh, wait, there's so much range. The tanks, tentacles, the tank. How fast are these guys? I can't tell because they're not actually. Oh my god, they have plus 10 move speed! Alright. Um, I'm just gonna get some more ultras here. Oh, that's not an ultralisk. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna get some boys here. And by some boys, I mean these guys are gonna become warhounds. Speaking my language. Okay, I'm gonna put it down here. Put them down here. Put them. I don't have enough minerals because they cost $5 million. That's okay, boys. Let's get down over here. Get those ultralisks over here. I still don't have my detection here. Um, that may or may not be a problem. May or may not be a problem. May or may not be a problem, boys. Um, can I actually? Can my ultralisks really not kill Stepman's units? Hmm. Hmm. I may have a little too much regenerative. I have too much regeneration. Not enough actual damage stats. Okay. 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 Um. There we go. I need to make sure. I'm, make sure I'm using all that space. Make sure I'm using all that space here. I think hopefully the warhounds will be will be good enough. Trooper standing by. Come on, give me another warhound. There we go. There we go. Get some more warhounds here. I got decent range on my warhounds with that plus one force, but it's definitely nothing compared to this guy's tanks, who are literally just gonna poke things with their tentacles. Um. That's crazy. <laughs> That's actually crazy, boys. Uh, anyways. Get in there. Get in there. Get that vision. I'm gonna use my Warhounds to destroy all of Stepman's mechanical units here. There we go. There we go. Got got a healthy amount of Ultralisk at the front. They got that blood on them, so unless they're getting focus fired, it's gonna take a really long time for them to go down. Aegis Guard is gonna get popped here. His Aegis Barrier does seem to be coming back off cooldown a little bit faster, so actually I think cooldown reduction does affect Aegis Guard, which is really cool. Um, not something that I, you would expect, I suppose. There we go, I'm gonna get some more, some more Warhounds here. And uh, I don't know, with uh, that's much cooldown reduction, uh, the world's the limit, sky's the limit, world's the limit, world's your oyster? World's your boister? Boisterous. Um, Ah, oh, there's the Banelings. Eventually you'll run into Banelings if you're facing Stepman. Oh, okay. We've got some nice art over here. Some uh, some real modern stuff. I'll put it I'll put it on the left one. That's the left one, right? Yeah, that's the left one. Alright. Um <laughs> Anyways, those tanks I mean those diamond bats just outrange the Nexus here. Um This guy literally has what what is his other modifier? I don't even know. Oh he has fire. He literally has such a great combo. Plus plus five range and then plus two more damage. Well I mean Sometimes you get hard carried. What can I say boys? Sometimes you get hard carried. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I was just out here chilling. Oh my god. Alright, well let's go for round two. Alright, let's let's go for round two, boys. Um, put down some some two little lings here. Uh, let's see what we got here. Ooh, ice, fire, and blood. Can I take all three of these? Just I just want all three of them. Just pick them all. Um, although we'll see what we're up against here. I'll probably have to just. I'm probably gonna take life before I take health. Uh, blood. I don't know. Oh, but blood. <laughs> but blood. I don't really need fire as much though, cause Manx just deals a lot of damage already, so it's like, fire is like uh, the icing on the cake, you know? It's like, uh, ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, I got, I'm tapping out here, uh oh, I didn't see what I'm up against. Uh, I tapped out here just to see, okay, well I don't know if I'm, uh, what I'm up against, all I know is that there's a Stepman in the next wave. Alright, well, we could just go in blind. Uh, let's go blood. And let's go life. And let's go force. It's looking very promising for a large amount of boys. Um, so let's do just that, boys. Get some LMG boys in here. 
give me some LMG boys here. There we go. I only picked half my auras, so this is only three auras on all of them. And I think that's going to be more than enough for the base already. Uh, that's the Kerrigan. Okay, that's what I thought. Kerrigan has plus three range. That's kind of terrifying, actually. Um, that's okay. Should be okay, at least. Just gun that queen down here real quick. Gun her down real quick. Da 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 My boy's got that got that regen here. And uh if anything. Uh yeah, the guy in first place, first position hasn't done anything. I'm gonna go tier two. I'm gonna go tier two just so I can like, you know, drop a little sneaky scan just to see what he's up to. Uh so I picked half my auras, and I mean they're already quite powerful. Um that's a bunch of stalkers. That's the Vorazun dream kind of this week, just stalker stacking. I don't even know if it's gonna be that great though, because your stalkers will eventually get gunned down. Um, in the streets, I'm gonna go for another another one of these. I don't want to overcommit to boys for now, but I, I will commit to economy because uh, the economy will pay you back eventually. Uh, I'm just oh my god, the lag. Am I lagging? Yeah. Man, it's. It's 9 a.m. in the morning. Who's who's using the internet on a Monday? I mean, I guess it's probably people working from home. I don't know. There's like a new lockdown in place for Ontario where it's like, you're not allowed to have gatherings of over 25 people, but you can have up to gatherings of 10 people. So what you're telling me is 10 people can get COVID all at once, but not 25. Oh, that guy's just not here. So there's just going to be another Stepman here. Oh, nice. It's gonna be it's gonna be Kerrigan Stepman. Oh, what do I do against that? Oh, I know. This unit is absolutely crazy to build. I'm gonna build it anyways. Let's go. Um, that's the only it's the only real known answer I think. I don't really have a good answer in the long run, so I'm just gonna go for it. Uh, so let's move that over here. And then it? let's move this over here. Uh, I'm just gonna tell my team. Maybe I'm going pride. I don't know. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go for a pride. And then they all leave. They're like, "Aight, we're out." Um, should I get more force or should I get more ice? Or should I get some water for some cooldown reduction? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Lamau, Stepman and Kerrigan together have no real answer to pride. Um, I mean, Stepman kinda with his Hydra list, but like, the pride can just obliterate like half of them. So I'm gonna actually go for water here. Show them the power of the sun, boys. I'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for water here. We're gonna do a little an aura switch. Um, I'll go for ice because I, I do want that extra armor. Oh, should I get blood for my pride? I do like that idea, but I feel like one blood is good enough, and I should just go for water so I have even more like survivability. I'm gonna go for water because I, I think one blood on my pride is fine. Um, should be able to help it shrug off like you know small amounts of damage and whatever. There we go. Alright, alright. We got a little baby tech switch here. I picked half my auras. And then tech swapped the other half. The first half of the auras is pretty good for the boys. Yeah, because all of them, like, my allies here are just, they're just sending it down here with all of these units here. Um, so, our opponents are just forced to, like, just try and stay alive. Like, my wave is not insignificant because 90 health, boys with extra range, they're pretty potent still, like, they're like just Hydralisk basically. I'm just sending out some Hydralisk every way. Uh, and I almost have my Prides here. So once the Pride arrives, we'll probably like just win the game, because Stepman doesn't really have a real answer to them. I don't want to invest too heavily in boys as well, because uh, what'll happen is, is, is Banelings. It's really unfortunate that I don't get to uh, have the Mansk enjoyment experience, which is large amounts of boys, uh, because there were two Stepmans back to back when I'm deciding to play some manks here. I'm actually not even gonna drop a skin so that the lurkers can stack. I'm, I'm sandbagging right now, boys. I'm sandbagging, as they say, right? That's 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 the word. Um, we got we got we got ten range on these asset spines. Uh oh, that's kind of terrifying. Not enough minerals, man. You tell me I gotta have my pride the next wave, man. All right, all right. We'll just have to wait for our candy, boys. How exciting! There we go. Five minute pride. Wait, that was a five minute pride. Well, that's actually crazy. I, I, I guess we've had like middle income for this whole time, so. Um, not really the worst. Uh, I do need a detector. Uh, yeah, Eisenhorn guy. Just DC'd. Uh, there we go. 
I'm gonna do that. Can I get the Pride a little bit closer? There we go. I'll get you a little bit closer here. And then I'm just gonna basically, I'm just gonna be playing, I'm just gonna be playing a capital ship command here. So we've sandbagged enough that uh, they're starting to push back on us. Um, so it's time to unleash the pride, boys. By unleash the pride, I mean like it's 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 coming out right soon, soon TM. I'm gonna send in more boys actually. This is this is the OG Terran composition, big battleship and lots of small boys. All right, let's get in there. This, I don't have the triple rank yet, but uh, it does have AOE. Uh, so let's make him eat it, boys. There we go. Can I not see those things? There we go. Da -da 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 -da. Hey, that's a broodlord. Nice broodlord, boys. Nice broodlord. I think the pride is taking some scratch damage here from those queens. There we go. Yeah, I'm just getting scratched by those queens here. I have enough. Uh, I have enough armor. I have eight armor, and then just a little bit of blood here. That'll probably survive for quite a lot of time. Okay, let's, let's, let's just go backwards here. Uh, grants you nearby only my ground units range though, so hmm. I'm gonna blink it back. There we go. On second thought, maybe I should have gotten an extra round of blood, but the extra cooldown reduction definitely feels pretty good. Definitely hits really different. Definitely hit diff. Who's gonna rescue me, boys? Let's get some who's gonna rescue me's in here. Uh, and then get the dual resuscitators. Is that the new one? No, this is the old one. This is the old one, just almost healing up all the way to full. Okay, nice. Uh, I'm gonna get the field assist targeting systems. And now, now it's massacre time, boys. Woo! There we go. Now it's massacre time. Uh, there we go, boys. I got extra range on all my boys here. I got that seven range here. Uh, I don't know why I'm gunning down the Overseer. Uh, there's a bunch of Hydros in the back. I don't think this Pride is actually taking any damage here. He's got 9 armor. Somebody just subscribe. Hello. Hello. The Pride is leading all of these Stalkers to victory here. Oh, the Pride does benefit the uh, my allied units. Okay, well that's perfect. Um, oh, let me let me just blink back over here so all my other allied units here can can get a little bit of a little bit of juice. Uh oh. Why are my Ultralis behind my boys? That is not good. Um, more importantly, I, I gotta rearrange my boy line. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Slap that over there. Ah, uh, ah! Okay, whatever. We'll, we'll come back and rearrange the rest of them. Um, we're in no real hurry. I'm gonna get another gas here. I'm getting another gas here. There we go. Alright, Hydralisk. Meet your doom. There goes all the anti-air, boys. Pride of August grad, boys. Wait, hold on, come back. <laughs> Pride of August grad, boys. Boop, boop, boop. Did I just shoot the Nexus three times? Wait, that thing's insane. It does 900 damage. If you had a webcam, you can see me pointing at the screen right now because that's absolutely insane. All right. Anyways, well, this is just pe this is top tier Manx enjoyment, boys. Um. <laughs> Alright, well if you guys enjoyed these two Manx games, be sure to leave a like. Uh, this is definitely uh, Manx with like a different flavor, I guess. It was like half of the old flavor with like super thick boys. But then it was like, oh hi, there's Stepman. So uh, we pivoted right to a uh, Giga Manx. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed Nine Armor August Grad, it's like six minutes basically that we got it out. Be sure to leave a like. And until next time, I will see you guys later. <laughs> the tires let's light some fires you need a light they picked the wrong place